Hello guys, in this video we will see how to install and configure OSS equal 17.5 on Fedora Linux 42. Okay, first open the any web browser, then go to OSS equal official website that is PostgreSQL.org. Hit enter. Okay, and then see here at the time of installation the latest release is 17.5 click on download then click on linux then see you don't have fedora but select the red hat rakia alma linux see here the post is equal memory positive currently supports on rhl rakia linux alma linux and fedora so select the version from this list then select the operating system fedora version 42 see once we selected it populated the list of the commands that needs to be executed so execute these commands one by one so copy the first one it is going to install the repository rpm for the process equal server open terminal paste it hit enter provide the password of sudo user hit enter it is done now install the force is equal server 17 sudo dnf install postgres equal 17 hyphen server but if you want to install 16 give hyphen 16 so i want to install latest one give the force is equal 17 hyphen server hit enter type and hit enter again See, it is installing process equal server 17.5 and these dependencies. Okay, type 5 for confirmation. Type and hit enter. See, we have successfully installed control A. Now, verify the status of the process equal server. Before running this one, first initialize the database by running this command paste it hit enter it is done now verify the status of the process equal server sudo system ctl status postgres equal hyphen 17 hit enter see process equal server is installed but it is not started and disabled so start it sudo system ctl start postgres equal hyphen 17 hit enter now verify see process equal server is started q to quit see here it is active and running and also see here the processes for the process equal server logger check pointer background writer wall writer auto vacuum launcher and replication logical replication launcher and this is the data direct okay see but see still it is not enabled so enable it sudo system ctl enable postgres equal hyphen 17 we have to give the version it is enabled now verify see postgres equal server is started and it is enabled quit to quit control a now connect to postgres equal server sudo su hyphen postgres psql see we have connected to postgres equal server notice here this is the version of the psql client version not the postgres equal server version to verify the version of the postgres equal server we have to run the command select version see we have installed process equal server 17.5 okay now the first step after connecting to process equal server is we have to set the password for the postgres user which is the super user okay by default we will get the only one user that is postgres backslash du is the command to verify see we have only one user we can also verify the list of the users by running the command select username from pg underscore user see we have only one user let us set the password for this user alter user postgres with password then provide the password see alter role means we have successfully set the password for this postgres user control in now if i stop databases see these are the default databases that comes with postgres equal server installation also we can get the list of the databases by running that name from pg underscore database see these are the default databases let us create database by running the command create 
database verify see we have created database let us create a table in this new database before that switch to database by using backslash c or backslash connect then provide the name of the database see now you are connected to database bank as user postgres now create a table create table See, we have created table in public schema. This is the name of the table, type of the object, and one of the table. Let us insert some data into this table. See, we have inserted these rows. Now, create user. Create user. See, whatever is there in single or double quotes, it is the password. Now, verify again. Backslash to you or you can run this select username from pg underscore user. See, we have created user. Now, exit from the first equal server which is connected by using the Postgres user and connect with this new user. Backslash Q is the command to exit. PSQL hyphen H localhost H means hostname. Postgres SQL is installed on this one. If it is installed on some other, then you have to give you the that hostname or IP. Hyphen U, you must be caps. Then David, username is David. Okay. Hyphen D, that is database name. Hit enter. We have to provide the password of this user. See whatever is there in singular double quotes, it is the password. See we have successfully logged in. Also verify the currently logged in user. Select current underscore user. See we have successfully logged in with the user David. Okay. Now try to access the database that we have created. Now run the query. Select star from customer. This is the table that we have created in this database. See permission in it for table customer because we have created user but we haven't granted any privileges that's why we have received this error okay so exit now you'll see how to stop start and restart process equal server on federal linux 42 or 41 so we can't stop or start this postgres user so exit sudo systemctl stop postgres equal hyphen 17 now verify the status see postgres equal server is inactive or dead Okay, Q to kit. We can also verify by trying to connect to Postgres equal server sudo su hyphen postgres. PSQL. See, we are unable to connect because Postgres equal server is stopped. So, start it again. Exit from the Postgres user sudo systemctl start postgres equal hyphen 17. If you don't give the version, it won't work. Okay, we have to give the version number. Now, verify the status. See, Postgres equal server started 3 seconds ago. Q to kit. Also try to connect sudo su hyphen postgres psql. See, we have successfully connected. Exit. Exit. If you want to restart, just give sudo systemctl restart postgres equal hyphen 17. We have successfully restarted. See, we have restarted 3 seconds ago. Control A. Until now, we have connected Postgres SQL Server by using PSQL Client. You can also connect Postgres SQL Server by using dbweaver or pgadmin. Those are the most popular tools. You can search for my YouTube channel how to install both pgadmin or dbweaver and Federal Linux operating systems. Okay. So, in this video, we have seen how to install and configure Postgres SQL Server 17.5 on Federal Linux 42. Okay. For more Postgres SQL tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.